Tangled Rail Tales help put the stories in order. Play. Can you help put the pages of the story in the right order? Well done! You are really useful. You did it! Now it's story time. On the way to the children's steam fair, Dash ran out of coal and couldn't go any further. Emily brought Dash some more coal. Later, Emily and Dash arrived at the fair together. The end. Untangle another story. Can you help put the pages of the story in the proper order? This story doesn't sound right. Can you help put the beginning, middle, and end of the story in the right order? That's one. You did it. Well done. That's it. Now it's story time. One day, Butch's new magnet became stuck to Thomas. Butch and Thomas could not turn the magnet off and get apart, and went to find help while still stuck together. Luckily, Victor told them how to turn off the magnet. Soon, Thomas and Butch were back to being really useful. The end. Untangle another story. Can you help put the pages of the story in the proper order? This story is all mixed up. You fixed it. You are really useful. Now it's story time. As Edward puffed up to Charlie, he saw that Charlie looked sad. Edward tried to cheer Charlie up by telling him a joke. Edward's joke did cheer up Charlie. The end. Untangle another story. Can you help put the pages of the story in the proper order? Help untangle the story by putting the beginning, middle, and end in the right order. You did it. That's one. You are a really useful engine. You fixed it. Now it's story time. One day, Gordon's buffer beam fell off at the diesel works after he crashed into a flatbed. Gordon was embarrassed that he had to use a diesel buffer beam while he waited for his to be repaired. Thomas reminded Gordon that the diesel buffer beam allowed him to keep working while he waited for the repair. Gordon and his diesel buffer beam puffed proudly out of the docks because he was still a really useful engine. The end. Untangle another story. Can you help put the pages of the story in the proper order? Can you help put the beginning, middle, and end of the story in the right order? You are really useful. That's one. You are a really useful engine. Hear this page. You fixed it.
Now it's story time. At Brendam Docks on Sodor Surprise Day, Thomas blasted his whistle to surprise Gordon. Thomas's loud whistle startled Cranky, and he dropped a box of fireworks, which exploded. Thomas felt terrible that the party at Callan Castle would now have to be cancelled because there were no fireworks. But Thomas saved the party by thinking of something even better than fireworks. Harold flying by with colourful lights. The end. Untangle another story. Help untangle the story by putting the pages in the. Hear this page. Hear this page. This story doesn't sound right. That's it. You are a really useful engine. This story doesn't sound right. Well done. That's it. Now it's story time. One day, Thomas and Percy needed to deliver a giant pink balloon to the showground for Mr. Bubbles. On the way there, the wind blew the giant pink balloon away. So Thomas went back to Mr. Bubbles and got a new purple balloon to deliver. Finally. After Thomas and Percy delivered the purple balloon, the giant pink one arrived all on its own. The end. Untangle another story. Can you help put the pages of the story in the proper order? This story doesn't sound right. You are a really useful engine. You are a really useful engine. Now it's story time. One day, Kevin wanted to shunt a flatbed of oil barrels like Thomas and Percy. When Kevin biffed into the side of the flatbed, he knocked it over. So Kevin lifted the flatbed and barrels back onto the track. The end. Untangle another story. Can you help put the pages of the story in the proper order? This story doesn't sound right. You are a really useful engine. Well done. You are a really useful engine. Now it's story time. One morning, James needed to bring Farmer McCall's sheep to the fair to have their picture taken for the paper. James had to go through a large Muddy puddle on the way, and was worried that he and the sheep would be too dirty for the photograph. The photographer was delighted to take a picture of sheep right from the field and such a hard-working sheepdog and engine. Their picture was on the front page of the Sodor Gazette the very next day. The end. Untangle another story. Help untangle the story. Hear this page. You fixed it. You are a really useful engine. That's one. Now it's story time. One day, Sir Topham Hatch shed was on fire. Fiery Flynn was called to the rescue. Flynn put out the fire with water from his water cannons. 
Sir Topham Hatt praised Flynn for putting out the fire. The end.